Welcome to the DEF CON 17 opening ceremony. Thanks for being here. The original title for this talk was Hastily Prepared Presentation by Sleep Deprived Hackers, but truly that didn't cut it with the content team. It uh, wasn't uh, distinct enough from the, the other uh, presentations for DEF CON, so here we go. Uh, welcome to Montreal. It's really great to see you all uh, in our hometown. Um, the, uh, the, the weather forecast for this week, uh, <laughs> severe thunderstorms, flash rainfall, overwhelming heat and humidity, and uh, I'm, I'm only talking about this morning, so check uh, the weather for this afternoon and, and the following days. No, but seriously, the weather can be sometimes a little extreme in Montreal in the, in the, in the middle of summer, like, uh, like now. Um, so make sure to check uh, the weather before wandering outside the walls of the venue. Um, and um, uh, it may not matter because it shouldn't rain. Uh, you, you might not want to go outside. I'm told that it shouldn't rain inside most of the hack labs. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you got your uh, Debian umbrella from, uh, from uh, our folks um, from Debian.ch. Uh, before moving on to other subjects uh, in this presentation, we wanted to first touch a little bit on uh, the Debian and DevConf codes of conduct. Uh, we, real, we realize it's a, a little bit heavy, uh, heavy stuff. Uh, it's early in the morning still for some of us, uh, but it, it's something we, 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 we really wanted to do and it's quite important to us. Um, if you're sitting in this room, you should really uh, already be familiar with the DevConf and the Debian codes of conduct. Uh, 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 so if you if you're not if you haven't seen if this is uh, uh, you haven't heard of these uh, before that's really your first DevConf assignment after this talk. Uh, the CUC doesn't just apply to the DevConf venue um, or with only your fellow developers. We expect everyone to abide by these rules uh, everywhere and with everyone uh, for this event and including for uh, towards uh, staff in the venue and for other visitors at the venue. Let's be respectful. Uh, sometimes just a phrase that, is it okay if I, and then listening to, and being attentive to the person's response, it can make a big difference. Um, Debian is a huge and diverse community, and even though we're all here together now, um, we should keep in mind that uh, DevConf attendees come from a very, very uh, diverse, um, diverse uh, variety of cultural and uh, social backgrounds. Let's be aware, uh, if you notice something uh, offensive or disrupting in behavior, please speak up. Uh, it's not up to anyone else but you to do something. Don't assume someone else will take care of it. And also, we wanted to say, let's be welcoming. Uh, you know, DEPCOM 17 could very well be the first DEPCOM for many people in this room, <clears throat> including on the stage, by the way. <laughs> um, and we're not all here with a big group of friends. Um, Please help everyone feel at home and find a home in the Debian community. There should always be an extra chair at our tables. Uh, if you'd like to report an incident uh, or just uh, let, let us know uh, about something um, so we, we can just keep an eye out and be aware, um, please be free to approach myself the other attendees with purple badges uh, like myself, uh, Lulutin, Gabriel, and as well as Marga. We're the local anti-harassment team. Um, and you can also write an email to uh, the anti-harassment at debian.org address. So, here we are. Uh, my name is uh, Jerome Lavamine on IRC. For those uh, who've uh, seen a couple of my messages on uh, the, the different channels, um, this is uh, Louis Philippe, aka Poyo, Gabriel Le Lutin, Abdel, and Tiago. And we should also mention um, Tawa, who might, you might have, you probably met actually, you probably checked you in when you came in uh, at the front desk, and uh, as well as Tasia, who's unfortunately not uh, in Montreal uh, these days. So I wanted also to begin by talking a little about like why we decided to organize DevConf. Uh, actually, we all lost a bet. No. <laughs> 
Uh, actually, seriously, one thing you may not know about all of us is that most of us aren't Debian developers. Um, and I really consider myself as more of a Debian user than a Debian developer. Um, I'm saying this because our group here organizing the, this conference, uh, it reflects a lot about Debian, I think. Uh, not just Debian, the operating system, uh, but Debian, the project, and Debian, the community. Uh, so that means, I think that should, that should be something that you, you should be aware of and, and keep in mind. Because the project itself has so much impact outside of just the developer uh, community. It inspired us uh, to dedicate significant time and effort to organize uh, this uh, DevConf here in our hometown. So really, well done developers, you're awesome. Uh, please stay with us next week for the Debian Users Conference, uh, featuring a live stream of myself, trying to figure out how System D works. Uh, <laughs> uh, obviously, we couldn't have done uh, we couldn't have done this without uh, the support from the uh, experienced uh, DevConf global team. Uh, thanks to everyone who contributed all the, the different teams, website, infrastructure, registration, publicity, sponsorship, bursaries, and of course, uh, the video teams, and any teams I'm not mentioning because uh, we're so excited. Uh, also, thanks, uh, a huge thank you to all the volunteers, um, even those Local volunteers who showed up a few days ago, you're still awesome. Um, and we're happy also to report that DevCom 17, uh, the, the team has been burnout free until now. Uh, hopefully it stays this way until the final report. Hosting us, uh, we've, we've really had a good relationship uh, uh, with the venue. We hope uh, it continues all throughout uh, DevConf. Uh, you can find this map at uh, the front desk as well as online on the wiki on the venue page. Um, feel free to really uh, look at it. We understand that Collège Maisonneuve is a big place. Uh, there's lots of nooks and crannies where you can get lost, especially if you're trying to get to the showers. Uh, <laughs> So, uh, so look at the, check out the venue map. Don't hesitate to come see any of us if you're lost or whatever. Or ping us on IRC. There should be Wi-Fi in, in all the, the areas. We've also um, made a, an area of the local points of interest. Uh, if you go on the wiki and click the uh, map area link, uh, there's a. We, we took some time to identify a couple places around uh, food, beer stores, uh, bars. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, supermarkets and all that, that kind of stuff, laundry mats, uh, laundromats, um, so, so you can uh, have a, an easier time finding your way around uh, the immediate area. Front desk uh, is, uh, you've probably, you've uh, most likely already uh, passed uh, by front desk. Uh, front desk is officially open from 10 to, to uh, 1 p.m. and then 2 p.m., 2.30 p.m. to, to uh, 6 p.m. Um, the hours are, are we're going to make our do our best to have longer hours, obviously. Um, but uh, we, you can be sure that there's going to be people there uh, at these hours. We've got uh, we've got a whole bunch of item, uh, some items for sale, like uh, power adapters. Uh, if you forgot your towel or whatever, we we can we really front desk is a place, place to be if you need anything uh, any assistance. <laughs> Also, we'd like to remind you that the venue is a public place, a public space. So, please don't leave your laptops or any sort of valuables unattended uh, to prevent theft. If you need somewhere to stash uh, valuables, you can use uh, the lockers on the first floor near the garden entrance. Uh, these, these are here for, for our, our use. You just need to uh, have a, a padlock or a combination lock. We're also happy to announce that DevConf is providing free childcare for uh, attendees, for the children of attendees. And <laughs> <laughs> and we're doing this in partnership with the Montreal Child Care Collective. So thanks also to, uh, to all the workers who are going to be with us uh, throughout the week. 
Uh, lots of the waste produced here is uh, recyclable. Uh, please uh, separate the waste from uh, any other uh, recyclable uh, uh, matter. Um, the green, green is for the cans and blue is for the paper. Um, but really, the, the really important stuff is just not to throw any recyclable in, uh, in the waste. Go ahead. <laughs> so, we've got uh, a 24-7 uh, uh, coffee station in, in, down in the internal garden. And another one in the, in the, um, in the cafeteria. Uh, there's there's people, volunteers assigned for quality assurance. If you notice anything missing, let us know. Um, alcohol co consumption. Uh, we we have a bar that's open in the, in the evenings from six to one uh, one in the morning. Uh, we ask that people um, stay in, stay in the garden or in the the rex room where we have alcohol permit, as alcohol isn't permitted uh, outside of these spaces on the venue. Uh, we, all, we also want to thank our caterer, who is a, a local, local caterer uh, here in the neighborhood, who has accepted the huge challenge of feeding DEFCONF attendees for, for the week. Um, we understand that we, issues might come up. We'll do our best to, uh, to address them. And so far, uh, the, the catering team has been uh, really responsive and listening to our concerns. So if anything, also regarding the food, uh, please uh, do let us know. So the conference schedule, of course, uh, is uh, available. You can uh, uh, check it out on the website. We do recommend that you use uh, Giggity or an, a Confluent, Confluent or another mobile application uh, to, uh, to organize your, your program, your stay at, uh, at, at uh, DEF CONF. Um, there is self-scheduling uh, available, lots of space, lots of time slots for self-scheduled uh, sessions. There's a grid uh, right next to front desk yeah, with the instructions. Uh, the, there's a link to instructions that you can uh, check out. We ask that people simply register their talk on the conference system um, before they're, uh, they're, they get uh, scheduled on the spot um, in, uh, in the official schedule. All the talks on the on the schedule will be uh, will be streamed. Uh, the talks that are going to happen in Buzz, Bo, and Rex, and uh, also we we encourage uh, everyone uh, uh, participating via remote via IRC to, to 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 join us to watch the live streams. Also in the program, social activities. Um, the, there's a there's a job fair fair that's going to be happening today at 2:30 in the main hall. The cheese and wine party is tomorrow evening, August 7th. Uh, we remind people who brought uh, donations to uh, for the cheese and wine party to come see us at front desk. Make sure we can have that uh, chill. The day trip is on Wednesday. Yeah, we remind also to uh, to sign up on the wiki for the different options. If you want to, um, to help uh, lead any group or whatever, uh, you can also come uh, see us and, and, help, and uh, help us um, uh, get all of this done. We, there's a conference dinner also, not to forget, on, uh, on uh, August uh, 10th. We're gonna have a dinner, or a, dinner a special uh, dinner in the, uh, the cafeteria and uh, followed by a party at the Montreal Tower uh, above the, the Montreal scene, which is right next to here. So it, it's really promising to be a, a great evening, and we we'll hope you will, you will join us. We want to also just give a quick shout out to the Wikimedia people who are in town. There's a big uh, Wiki, uh, Wikimedia Foundation conference happening in Montreal this week. Uh, so hello to anyone who's, uh, who's from uh, the, Wikimedia, the Wikimedia side, and, uh, and obviously if you want to check out their, their event, uh, you're welcome to do so. Thank you also to our, our many sponsors, without which uh, support wouldn't uh, there's without who support uh, this conference uh, would not uh, be possible. <laughs> uh, okay, 
Um, so yeah, finally, if you if you uh, if you're looking to contact anyone from uh, the organizing team, you can reach us at IRC on the DevConf uh, 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 team uh, channel on irc.oftc.net. The front desk number uh, is, uh, is uh, open 24 hours. Uh, um, at this number, you can send SMSs as well. Please also, obviously, use it use it sparingly um, during uh, after hours. And all, as, uh, obviously, the mailing list also um, DevConf team uh, at uh, list.devconf.org. Um, if you have any anything to share, any concerns or feedback about uh, this uh, this event, so thank you. That's that's all for us for now, and we hope to see you every uh, everyone else at, at all during the week. Thanks. Is there maybe a question we can have maybe a minute for to take questions or Just keep in mind when you send your flames to DevCon team at list.debian.org that that's a public list and it's archived and no list masters won't help you fix your life choices. <laughs>